Hey, and welcome back to another video. So this is just a quick video to answer a question that I've been getting on one of my videos. Uh, I'm shooting this at 1.30 in the morning of the 17th. Um, this is just a quick video to answer the question that I've been getting on my uh, Apple Watch Series 0 video. A few people had asked me, um, is the Series 0 and Series 1 compatible with iOS 14. Now, since you know that on the 16th yesterday, iOS 14, watchOS 7, and iPadOS 14 were released. So people are a bit worried on updating their phones if the, they're, and they're worried that their Series 1 and Series 0 are not going to work with iOS 14. And I'm here to answer that question. But before we jump right in, don't forget to hit that like button and check out my channel. And if you like what you see, please consider hitting the subscribe button, hit that bell notification button to get notified whenever I upload a new video. I'm on Discord, Instagram, and Twitter, and you can find me on those using the links down in the description below. Okay, so let's get into this. So the answer is straightforward, yes, and I'll prove it to you. So which one do I have connected now? Let's see, I'll open watch. So I have my Series 5 connected and I'm sorry for the bad lighting. I need my, I use this phone, my iPhone 11 to record videos. I'm using an old Xperia to record the video. So it's kind of grainy. So sorry about the bad quality. Apple Watch Series 5. So I'm, this Series 5 actually has not been updated. It's still running watchOS 6. But as you can see, the Series 5 connects with um, the iPhone, as you can see there. Um, so that's good. So Series 0, um, the one I've named Stainless Steel 2 here because I have another Stainless Steel Series 0. Stainless Steel 2 is this. Um, and let me show you that it connects just perfectly. This is running 4.3.2, the, the last version of the Apple Watch Series 0 OS. I really can't remember what it was. But look, see? It connects just fine. Um, let's go back. Let me go to general. About um, version 4.3.2. As you can see there, it says 4.3.2. So that was the last version of uh, OS supported for the Series 0. And as you can see, it connects just fine. It's just taking a while to update because it's an older device. Update in the sense my fitness has still not transferred over to that. I've got 74 calories, two hours and two minutes. Uh, it still hasn't transferred over, but that's because there's just a lag on the uh, watch itself. Uh, but Series Zero connects just fine and works. Let me just run a quick um, blah, 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 blah. Let me just run a quick workout for you. As you can see, it works. Everything works fine. Um, so Series 0 connects and works perfectly with iOS 14 and this iPhone is running iOS 14. Um, okay, so Series 1, I'm actually varying it here. This is a Series 1 and I've been w using this throughout the day after updating to iOS 14. So let's go into all watches, uh, Apple Watch Series 1, aluminum case. Um, and this is the one I've been using this all day, so I know it works for sure. Um, come on, connect. It takes a while to connect, but it does connect. But there we go. So Apple Watch Series 1 connects, done. Let's go into general about Series 1, running the latest version for the Series 1, that is 6.2.8. So Series 1 works, Series 0 works with iOS 14 as you can see here um, This is iOS 14 and obviously the series 5 is going to work as well Okay, so I guess and I hope that all your answer your, your questions have been answered the series 1 and series 0 Do work perfectly on iOS 14. So go ahead and update your phone to iOS 14 and uh, I hope you enjoy all the new features um, and I hope that your older Apple watches will work for as long as you need them to uh, before you need to upgrade to a new one. But again, the, the, I, the Apple Watch SE is a good choice. It's basically a Series 5 without the always on feature. Um, I think it does not have the always on. I'm not sure, but I, yeah, it does not have the always on. But it's basically a Series 5 without the always on. Um, but yeah, I guess that's it for this video. Just a quick video to answer a few questions. Um, 
I hope you I hope your questions were answered and thanks for watching. Don't forget to like this video and check out my channel and if you like what you see, please consider hitting the subscribe button, thumbs up and I'll see you guys in my next video.